hello guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video I'm going to show you how you can downgrade uh, the iPod touch 4 to iOS 4 or 5 through the geek grade IPSW files so first of all you want to head over to the mega link in the description of my video and you want to download all the files over there so once you're done with all the files you want to put your iPhone into DFU mode so you want to hold the power and the home button of your iPod together for around 10 seconds or so. So I'm going to press the words. So I'm going to release the power button and I'm going to continue on holding the home button. So once the iPod appears on your computer, it means that it is in DFU mode. So now you want to head over to the Red Snow folder and you want to click on the Red Snow app. Now you want to head over to Extras and then you want to select Phone DFU. And this is going to put your iPod into Phone DFU mode. So once this is done, you need to click quit and then you need to head over to iTunes so once in iTunes this pop-up will come up you can just click OK and then you want to press alt option if you uh, uh, on Mac so you want to press alt option and then you want to press restore so now you want to head over to the iPod touch for iOS 4.3.3 folder and you want to select the geek grade IPSW file. If you want to click on it, you want to click open. So now this is going to restore. So once this finishes, your iPod should still be in recovery mode. So now what you want to do is you want to put it in DFU mode once again. So once you're back into DFU mode, you want to go back to Red Snow. You want to go into Red Snow here. And now you want to go to extras once again and now you want to click on select IPSW and you want to select the second IPSW in the iPod touch for iOS 4.3.3 folder so the one that says restore so I'm going to select that IPSW I'm going to click OK now I'm going to click just boot so now your iPod touch should be booting So now we have successfully booted into iOS 4. Now we just need to activate the iPod through iTunes. So now my iPod is activated and we have successfully downgraded our iOS version. So I'm just going to show you if you go to general and about in settings. We are running iOS 4.3.3. So if you want to jailbreak iOS 4.3.3, you can jailbreak it through Red Snow. So yeah, I hope you guys like this video, bye.